Hey folks, this is Kalani. Welcome back to the Vault of the Incarnates raid guide for Normal and Heroic. In this video, we'll be taking down the Primal Council. You'll face off against all four bosses at the same time, and they all use their abilities together. Opal Fang and Ember Firepath need to be tanked, while Dathia and Kadros mostly cast spells. I suggest you keep Dathia and Kadros interrupted to keep them in melee with the other bosses to maximize your cleave damage. Opal Fang will summon Earthen Pillars at random player locations, which deal a lot of damage when they erupt, so avoid that. They also use Crush on their current tank target, dealing damage and increasing physical damage taken, so you'll need to tank swap. Dathia uses Conductive Mark. This puts a blue circle around random players that deals damage over time, and if anyone else moves into that circle, the debuff will spread, so do not run over other players. To get rid of these circles, the marked players need to run next to an Earthen Pillar. Ember Firepath will use Slashing Blaze at 100 energy. This deals heavy fire damage to the tank and anyone in front of the boss, so face it away from the raid and it deals damage over time, so you'll be tank swapping between Opal Fang and Ember Firepath. The other fire ability is Meteor Axis. The boss marks two players with big red circles that explode, dealing a lot of damage. You'll need to split this damage with at least two other players or use a big defensive cooldown. It also leaves fire pools on the floor, which will be important in just a second. These axes will also break earthen pillars, so if you are running out of room due to the pillars, use the Meteor Axes to destroy them. And then Kadros will use Primal Blizzard at 100 energy. This deals raid-wide damage for 10 seconds and applies a debuff to everyone that increases their frost damage taken and reduces fire damage taken. If you ever get to 10 stacks, you'll be frozen in an ice block and you'll need to be broken out. To avoid that, you'll want to clear your stacks at around 5 to 6 by stepping into a fire pool left by the Meteor Axes. Every single boss also deals heavy, constant raid-wide damage when they die, so you have to kill them all at the same time or as close together as possible. On Heroic Mode, Earthen Pillars deal constant raid-wide damage, so you have to destroy them when you can, and then the Meteor Axe Big Circles have to be soaked separately. You can't stack them up due to a new debuff in Heroic that will one-shot you. So, for a quick recap, dodge earthen pillar spawns, take lightning circles to the earthen pillars, break earthen pillars with meteor axes, and split the meteor axe impact damage with a few players. Use the fire pools left by meteor axe to clear the stacks of your frost debuff. On heroic mode, make sure you destroy the earthen pillars often enough and don't stack the meteor axes. And that's everything you should need to take down the primal council on normal and heroic. Stay tuned for more boss guides for the Vault of the Incarnates raid. Thanks for watching, folks. Good luck and have fun, and as always, I will see you next time.